Welcome back to Selly Entertainment. I'm your host, Ryan Vincent, and tonight we got soccer. The West Coast FC versus AC Richmond. This is the first division played at King George Canby Park in Richmond, BC. Richmond, BC. Fabulous Richmond, BC. And I must be lost because this is grass. This is not ice. I am used to sitting in the ice rink, but I have found my way out onto the soccer field. And we've got the AC Richmond in the red. Their goalie is Uli. And on the other side, we're in the white. That's the West Coast FC. And their goaltender is Clapperton. Yeah, their goaltender's Clapperton, Simonson. There we go, breaking it off. There's the AC Richmond number five with a huge shot and a nice save by Clapperton. I love saying that name, Simonson. Look at that, nice little chip pass from number 12. Right to number five, Alberto there, coming straight from the hair salon there. And Alberto has a shot and a nice easy save by Clapperton. With that name, he should be playing hockey. Yeah, Clapperton sprawls out, laying down and stopping that ball and giving it a little hug like he's Cuddling at night. Or, or, there you go. Uh, uh, laying down like a real soccer player after taking a weak hit, Simonson. I guess so. I guess so. I'm unfamiliar, but here we are. The ball is bouncing around. West Coast sends a field goal, and that's part of football. I know that. Yeah, Simonson, number eight, Al Dramashi there. Just thought he was playing for the Broncos there and decides to kick a field goal. How can you miss a net that big? That's what I want to know, Simonson. Well, these are different things. They're, where's the sticks? Here they are. They're narrow. It's a corner kick. Oh, no, it's held in by the West Coast FC player. And it's on the line. And he hits his own player and deflects it out of bounds. And it looks like it's going to be a throw-in for the AC Richmond. Yeah, look. Well, Al Dramashi there kicked the flag. And then you see Anderson, number 10 there, hits his own player. And this is my favorite part of the whole play, Simonson. He's going to somehow argue it like a soccer player does. And then he's going to flick his hair back. Well, hey, being a soccer player is all about having a nice haircut on the field. You're absolutely correct, Simonson. It's nothing more, nothing less, all about the hair. Speaking of hair, there's number six with a beautiful flow and a nice little move there. Puts the puck in front of the net there and has a shot. Oh, huge save by Yuli. They're using a soccer ball, not a puck, but there we are. So look at that. Nice little Jimmy, ja Jimmy leg dash and then sends it in front. And then there's a West Coast player Throws it to the net, big kick, and it's a nice save by Uli! Uli! Yeah, nice shot by Varley, number nine there. Huge save by Uli! Anyways, there's a AC Richmond. Wait, hoping this was an air conditioned field, but it's not. There's Herman Sidhu in the middle, feeds number six. Number six has a shot there. It looked like it was going wide, anyways, but the goalie wanted to make it look flashy, Simonson. This was an unnecessary save, not needed. No, you know what, though? You gotta stay limber and you gotta keep your yourself in the game as a goaltender and if you're a Uli you want to stay as much involved as you can or else you'll get cold just standing there. Yeah very true there's a lot of standing around in soccer when you're the goaltender I know because I used to be one Simonson. There's Herman there in front of the net there oh it looks like the AC kicked the puck there but it's West Coast there who fires it oh look at that they score number nine Varley with the beautiful assist by number 10 Anderson and West Coast is on the board first in this outdoor soccer game in Richmond. That's right. Yet again, it's a, called a soccer ball, not a puck there, coach. But yeah, a nice footwork there and nice little passing play there. And I like the way that it stops short and then it's kicked right through the front of the net there. And then number 10 comes in with a sideways kick and that one goes diagonally in. Yeah, one of his players just put the insurance on that, Simonson. Like he put a you know, like, like it was fire and flood insurance, like he just bought a house. And I like that little hook kick that their player did too to keep that ball, not puck, from staying in and not going out. Nonetheless, it's one nothing for West Coast there, Simonson. There, there you go, West Coast. Oh, a little bit of a tackle and there's a penalty on number eight, Aldermash on, on two up. Oh, let's run that back. Okay, so I don't know how if there's a card or anything that happens here because I'm unfamiliar. But uh, he kicked the ball away, and I don't know what's happening. Uh, Simonson, usually uh, the ball just goes the other way when there's a penalty there. No player sits in the box. If it's vicious, they'll flash a card, but the same thing happens. Nonetheless, 
Here's AC Richmond there, one-on-one -on -one with Wesco. Oh, has a nice shot and a nice easy save by Clapperton. Good goalie positioning by Clapperton. Yeah, I don't know. Clapperton was ready for that one, getting involved in the game a little bit here. Oh, four for the red AC Richmond coming off of the side of the field and goes for a shot and a good grip on that ball by Clapperton like he was at home by himself in his own bed. Oh, he's gripping that hard, Simonson. He has a, he's had a lot of practice there, so he's really good when it transitions to soccer from his bedroom. Number six there has a shot. Nice, easy save by Yuli. Yeah, Yuli knocks that one down like I knock mosquitoes down flying around in my house. Oh, Simonson, did you see that? Well, number four, DeSouza there. Threw a little bit of a left hook at number 12, Jordan. I'm going to run this one back. There's the Souza there, number four. Look at this. Uh, AC's going, oh, yeah, you can see that hook there, Simonson. I don't think it was on purpose, though. I think he was just flailing his arms around like a soccer player does, losing control of his own body, and then he just kind of got the hook on him. Yeah, well, I'm glad that he's going to recover from that devastating uh, backhand slap. And uh, here we go. Oh, now there's a hit. Now there's a real man hit, Simonson. <laughs> Number 11, I'm going to butcher this name. Issei goes down hard, Simonson. Now that's a real hip check. You see that kind of stuff in hockey. And, and you know what? Uh, here it is in soccer, Simonson. You know what? Hey, that one's got a hoit. But anyways, the ball is tossed in from the sideline there and there 17 for the west coast has it oh look at them fancy moves gets tripped up a little bit there and that looks like it's going to be in favor of west coast yeah i would say that's a tripping call simon i mean i like the theatrics of how he stiffened up his body and went down right away but nonetheless that was a tripping call and uh yeah jordan got the tripping call at number 17 pasha yeah no, there's the ball thrown to the front of the net and then the west coast gets it again yuli with a big save diving superman and he spending a lot of time on his ass and he gets right back off the grass there we go four again for the ac richmond uh back in that spot of his it's deflected and it's bunted out with a head bump into the amazon into the Amazon, Simonson. Yeah, right where Wonder Woman is. Oh, look at that. The West Coast number three, Legal. I would call, consider this some kind of hooking and holding play, number 18, McIntyre. Look, he got his arms around him. He was going for the backwards hug, sort of like uh, he's used to. But this time, he's going to get called on a penalty for it. Yeah, it's a vertical spoonage that was happening there. Uh, yes, yeah, yes, that's what it was, Simonson. I'm not too sure what happened here. We're going to have to run this back there. There you go. There's a throw in there by AC Richmond. Oh, right there. Number 19, Cooner there. Just hit Jordan from behind there. And look, Jordan was getting up. And then he looked around. And then he fell down and grabbed his head. Now, this is, this is the classic soccer theatrics that I love, Simonson. No, that's just a classic ICBC rear ender fender bend. Oh, that's what that is, Simon said. I mean, when they're watching, you know, you got to play the part there. Um, and I don't know if there's a penalty on the play here. Let's have a look at this. Number seven there. Kind of got his legs tangled up, and Richmond went down. And, and yeah, I guess Dylan got the penalty for that. Um, I guess that was some sort of ICBC crash too, Simonson, if you want to put it that way. Yeah, and the crowd just is irate, losing their bananas <laughs> over the way the officiating is going in this game. And it's just absolute mayhem. <laughs> yeah, and that's the first half, Simonson. One half down, one half to go in this barn burner of a game. One nothing. Tons of goals scored, tons of hits, tons of action. Anyways, there's West Coast number 10, Anderson there. Nice pass right to number five, LeVar Sager. Oh, chips it over the goaltenders. And what a huge save by Richmond's number 15, Talvinder, to prevent that puck from going in the back of the net, Simonson. That puck that's a ball gets past the AC Richmond player, ends up on five's foot, and Yuli comes flying out, and he was able to jump over, and 15 of the AC Richmond is a hero today. He is the hero that nobody needed, Simonson, in this game we call soccer. And oh, wow, the puck just went in, Simonson, just like that. The West Coast score, and I think that Herman might have got his head on that, and that could be his goal. Goal, coming straight from uh, WW Solutions, where we work, to the soccer field to get this goal. I want to run this one back, Simonson. You can see right here at number 18, Lolly there has a shot. And right there, there's Herman, number 14. Boom! I think he might have got the shoulder on that ball, Simonson. Nonetheless, I know that he touched it because he told me the next day that was his goal. And I love to see a teammate slash co-worker co-worker score, Simonson. Hey.
Hey, it's always fun when you know someone. Alrighty, now we've got a brand new score of 2-0. The only soccer term I know for the West Coast FC over the AC Richmond right now. There's the ball thrown in from the sidelines. People are hitting heads or something. I don't know. And there's a big kick. Yeah, there's a big kick. <laughs> so there's a, well, for the, right there, 14 Sanu got his head smacked by DeSouza there, DeSouza. And then he just kind of flings DeSouza and throws him down after. And you know what, Simon? I think you're doing pretty good with your soccer terminology in this game. I have no idea. I know the ball is going back and forth. People are trying to get it. And that is what I know about the game and guess who comes out with it it's the AC Richmond they throw it in deep deep in the box and a kick to the hamstring yeah Simonson it looks like their legs got intertwined there like they just finished a bottle of wine on a Friday night and they're about to go to bed there oh that didn't look pretty there Simonson number four D'Souza number five Alberto there got his knee taken out you can see D'Souza right there look he's throwing up the arms like did I do that Oh, did I do that? Did I do that? Grab your suspenders and give them a snap and let's get back at it. All right, the ball is chucked in from the sidelines again. And it's AC with it. They're trying to do something. And it looks like it gets punted out of the atmosphere. But it comes back in like Apollo 13. And then there. It sure does, Simonson. But wow, there is an absolute kick to the ribs. You can hear this one. There's going to be some arguing. If you turn up the volume, number nine, Beckon, right there. Look, that was a hard kick to DeSouza there. Um, yeah, you could actually hear that one. It clipped his ribs there. It sounded absolutely painful. So I got to give it to that kid. That, he took that one like a champion. You don't say that very often when it comes to soccer players. No, you don't. But you know what? I've seen a lot of uh, hard hits here, mostly from people getting kicked in there. And that's an uh, unfortunate mishap with this sport. I'm sure it happens frequently. But there we are. AC with a shot. And Clapperton claps it away. Yeah, I I'm going to hit the post there, Simon. So nonetheless, that was a good shot. AC, air-conditioned Richmond there. Feeling nice and cool from the air-conditioned that's not at the uh, arena <laughs> and uh, number nine from AC Richmond has a shot and a nice easy save by Clapperton yeah Clapperton makes a nice save there off alternating current Richmond here we are there alternating current Richmond again coming in four and he dishes it off to five four five where's number six because I'm learning to count right here and there's the ball just sitting there and it's dished off to somebody that misses not by much was that Wesley wide Simonson how do you miss that that was was a clear-cut goal uh, nonetheless there uh, oh man looks like one of the West Coast players got rocked here anyways let's have a look at this AC Richmond fires that puck up nice and high and right here you can see oh actually that yeah that was the AC Richmond player number 18 McIntyre he hit uh or he, sorry, he hit McIntyre from behind there. I can't. I don't know these players and their names. I'm all sorts of confused, Simonson. Yeah, well, where's the ice? Um, here we are. The ball is bouncing because it's full of air, and then they're kicking it around on the sidelines. West Coast is coming down like they're the West Coast Express because they got their ticket, and that's a big save by Yule, who goes and gives it a big time punt. Yeah, that was a big save, Simonson. Right here, you can see West Coast there. Look at this, a nice chip pass. Right to one of their players, number 13, Maddie there. Maddie with the huge header. And a, he, that was a nice save, Simon said. I want to see more of that kind of stuff happen in this game. That's the action I'm here for, I guess. And now, here's the ball. They've got it. Somebody. And then somebody goes tumbling like a tumbleweed. Yeah, I think Alberto's going to get the penalty on that, Simon said. We're going to have to run this one back. Oh, he's getting carded. Our first card of the game. Not sure what it's for. There's Alberto, number five. Looked like he did absolutely nothing to their player and their player just played that one off again theatric simonson yeah i don't know what's happening <laughs> but then let's keep the action rolling you got a full other 51 cards to go with that deck yeah, i think so simonson it's one big table of blackjack going on and no one's hitting properly because everyone's just falling without getting hit uh, there you go west coast complete had the chats of his life here number seven uh surreal there Wide open that, look at this, chance of his life there, Simonson, and just like every other time that he was in high school and he asked out a girl, he got denied. Yeah, goes sailing wide, even though it's a much bigger net and they're not using a stick, but here we are. 
on the field at nighttime, and there's a battle in the center of the field, and something's happening again. Again, Simonson, it's seven on seven crime there. Dylan throws number seven, Sarir, by the shirt, and yeah. I mean, stuff's happening, I guess, Simonson. I would like to see a little more stuff happen, but uh, it is what it is. I'm just milking this game for as many highlights as I can get, Simonson, because there wasn't much action. Yeah, and I don't know. Here we go. The ball goes flying through the air, and then it goes along the ground, and there's another whistle. And that's the end of the game, Simonson. West Coast is going to take this one 2 to nothing in a jam-packed barn burner of a game. Non-stop full of action. Non-stop soccer, football, whatever you call it, two goals, that's a game.